सेवेंथ प्रॉब्लम शो दैट x प्लस वाई प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो टचेस टचेस द सर्किल सर्किल एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस सेवन वाई प्लस फोर्टीन इज इक्वल टू जीरो फाइंड इट्स फाइंड इट्स पॉइंट ऑफ कंटैक्ट पॉइंट ऑफ कंटैक्ट शो दट दिस एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो टच द सर्किल एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस टू वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर्टीन इज इक्वल टू जीरो दिस इज द वन पार्ट ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम अदर पार्ट ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम इज एट विच पॉइंट इट टच द सर्किल दैट इज कॉल्ड पॉइंट ऑफ कंटैक्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट सो दैट मीन्स इन ऑर्डर टू प्रूव दट द लाइन टच द सर्किल मीन्स कंडीशन फॉर टैंजेंसी एज टू बी टेस्टेड सो वॉट इज द condition for tangency for circles the perpendicular distance drawn from the center to the line must be equal to the radius of the circle that means very simple r is equal to d it is enough to prove that radius is equal to the dis distance perpendicular distance the second how to find out the point of contact point of contact means in intermediate first year in straight lines you might have studied the foot of the perpendicular drawn from the point on the line so that means foot of the perpendicular from center of the circle to the tangent is nothing but that is the point of contact so that means first we have to test for tangency next go for to find out point of contact okay equation of the circle सर्किल इज एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस सेवन वाई प्लस फोर्टीन इज इक्वल टू जीरो दट मीन्स दिस इज द सर्किल सर्किल टचेस द लाइन दिस बी पॉइंट ऑफ कॉन्टैक्ट सेंटर सी जस्ट जॉइन इट द पी वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट so we can determine center so this will be the radius only say d okay now here 2g is equal to minus 3 2f is equal to 7 c is equal to 14 g becomes minus 3 by 2 f becomes 7 by 2 so center is equal to minus g comma minus f so 3 by 2 comma minus 7 by 2 this is the center of the circle let us find out radius r is given by root of g square plus f square minus c This is root of g square. Carefully do it. Nine by four plus forty-nine by four. This is minus fourteen. Forty-nine plus here root of four LCM fifty-eight Minus fifty-six. This is two by four, one by root two units. This is the radius. Now d we have to find out. So d is nothing but 
foot of the perpendicular sorry d is nothing but length of the perpendicular from c 3 by 2 comma minus 7 by 2. to x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. This is mod of 3 by 2 minus 7 by 2 plus 1 by root of 1 plus 1, 1 square plus 1 square that is 1 plus 1 only. This is minus 4 by 2 minus 2 plus 1. So, this will be mod minus 1 by root 2. So, 1 by root 2. See what do you find R and D both have the same values that is why R is equal to D. Therefore, x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0 touches the given circle first completed. So, now let us come to the point of contact we have to find out that is very very important part. So, h comma k say point of contact. So, foot of the perpendicular foot of the perpendicular from c on the line x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. Let us recall the formula h minus x 1 by a k minus y 1 by b is equal to minus of a x 1 plus b y 1 plus c by a square plus b square. This is the formula. Okay, you might be recollected. So, now substituting here h minus x 1 means this is 3 by 2 by a, a means here x coefficient is 1 k plus 7 by 2 by 1 is equal to minus of here 3 by 2 plus 7 by 2 plus c plus 1. Okay. Here that is minus 7 by 2 by a square plus b square 1 plus 1. Now, rub it. This h minus 3 by 2 k plus 7 by 2 is equal to this will be minus 4 by 2 minus 2 plus 1 minus 1 by 2 minus of minus plus 1 by 2. First you take these two next you take these two you get two equations h minus 3 by 2 is equal to 1 by 2 h is equal to 3 by 2 plus 1 by 2, 4 by 2, 2. k plus 7 by 2 is equal to 1 by 2, k is equal to 1 by 2 minus 7 by 2 minus 3. Therefore, point of contact, point of contact is h comma k that is 2 comma minus 3 this answer.